Hi folks, I'm Ian Baker, the product specialist here at American RV in Grand Rapids, Michigan. Today I'm here to tell you about the Winnebago Winnie Drop 1780. This is a great couples coach, nice and short, lightweight at 2,700 pounds. This is easily towable by a lot of your smaller SUVs with a V6. Let's go ahead and start right up here on the front. One of the things I love about this coach is you have this massive U-shaped dinette right here, which is really nice if you, you know, like to entertain, have guests, friends and family that want to come in the camper. Everyone can play a board game here, eat a meal together. And plus, this turns into a huge bed. If guests want to stay the night, the table just swings, it drops right down, it'll sit along these rails right here, fill it in with the cushions on top, and this bed is easily large enough for two people to be able to sleep here. You'll see you have windows on both sides which are nice, allow for a nice cross breeze and a shelf going right along the top here as well as a LED light to make it nice and bright again while you are sitting there at the table. Now if you want to watch some TV that's not an issue because you have a TV right here hooked up to your multimedia center. This does have a DVD player in there so if you want to watch a movie you can pop it right in. It's also a radio CD player and it's Bluetooth capable so if you have a smartphone or a tablet uh, you can easily go ahead and connect to that via Bluetooth. You'll also notice right up here you have the King Jack antenna. Cool thing about that is you don't have to worry about cranking it up and down, you don't have to worry about forgetting it. With the King Jack, all I have to do is turn it to find the, the best signal and that will pull in your local HD channels right there on the TV. You'll also notice you have a couple controls up here including your slide out control. That's right, 2,700 pounds and you have a slide out kitchen, pretty darn cool. If you take a look underneath, you'll see some extra storage. They have the nets here so it is nice and easy to access things that you want in there without having them fall out. So I mentioned a slide, let's take a look at that real quick. Across the way here is your slide out kitchen. You have the Dometic fridge here with your drop down freezer. Controls are right here on the outside, easy to get to, pretty simple, on off and auto. The reason for auto is because this unit runs off both propane and electric and auto is your automatic switch over. So what that means is if you're running this unit off propane and you plug it into shore power, it'll automatically switch it over to electric for you, saving you on your propane gas. Right above that is your combination microwave and oven. It's a convection oven. They work great. Uh, it's a space savings. You have two in one, plus it cooks faster than your standard oven and it's a heck of a lot easier to clean. Then right over here is your main prep surface. You'll see they do give you a sink top cover here so you're able to utilize this surface. You have some back here as well which does give you ample room for a coffee pot and you'll see there's a plug in right there for that. If you take the sink top cover off, it'll reveal your single bowl sink there with your high rise faucet. And right next to that you have the two burner cooktop. Underneath is some additional storage. You see you have two full extension ball bearing drawers, nice long drawers here, which are great because that gives you ample room for your silverware up top and still allows you this drawer for some of your larger utensils like your spatulas. Right next to that, you'll see some additional storage. Of course, right now we have the power cord stuffed in there, but you do have uh, enough room down there if you wanna put cleaning supplies or some pots and pans, that is a good place to put them. You see you have a big window right here, well big for the size of the kitchen anyway, uh, but a nice window there to let in some natural light during the day. And then at night you have an LED light here, uh, you have LED lights throughout the entire coach. If you take a look right up top there, again you'll see some extra storage, nice little pantry area. Across the way here is the bathroom, this is a fully functional wet bath. Uh, one thing I always like to talk about on the Winnebago products are the doors themselves. This is a great door. You'll see it's actually framed out in wood here. It shuts nicely every time. You don't have to worry about it popping back out on you. But if we take a look at the wet bath here, you'll see the floor is your shower basin. Of course, the toilet right next to that. Shower curtain right up here along the back as well as behind that shower curtain, you have a place uh, to put some of your shampoo, a couple other things in there. Right up top here is your uh, vent so you can quickly get the moisture out, LED light, hand wand there for easy showering, that is uh, connected right down there, you can see your sink there as well. Now the walls in here are a vinyl material so you don't have to worry about these getting wet, they can, they can get wet, it is not a problem, they are intended and designed to do so. Right above me you will notice the AC, that's really cool to have on this unit, nice powerful AC here to make sure the unit stays nice and cool. Then right up front, this of course is your bed. You'll see you have windows all the way around here which are great, really allow for a uh, great breeze coming through. 
right down below you'll see an electrical outlet so if you do have cell phones you want to plug in or if you have you know CPAP machine or something you know you have this nice little shelf probably not big enough for a CPAP machine but great place for your cell phones you can set them right there and then plug that in accordingly and then if you're able to see underneath I know it's kind of dark but that is a huge storage area under there as well which is great uh, personally myself I'd probably put a laundry basket under there or something for some of your dirty clothes but whatever you want to fit under there it does provide great extra extra storage. But all right, folks, that pretty much wraps it up. Now, again, this is a 2017 Winnebago Winnie Drop 1780. This one is in the graphite interior. If you're interested in this RV and you'd like price and availability, I recommend you give us a call here at American RV, or you can take a look at our website, which is AmericanRV.com for the most up-to-date information. Thanks again for watching. I'm Ian Baker, and I can't wait to see you on the road to freedom.